How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to add uh, Google Ads um, in your website in uh, the program iWeb. Now, as you know, iWeb um, came out, or it, it's an older program for the Mac, but it's one of the easiest programs to use in terms of building websites and ads and whatnot. Uh, it doesn't come on any of the newer Macs. It, it only comes on the older Macs probably two, three years back or more. And I think this one's actually the iWeb 2007 or 2008, one of the two. Uh, so for those of you that still use iWeb, you probably noticed that um, if you go up here and you try to set your Google AdSense account, this no longer works and there's no patch for it and Apple's basically not supporting the program anymore. But there is a workaround that you actually can use to still add um, Google Ads to your website and I just built a full website with ads and so I'm going to show you how to get ads for your site. So first of all let me pull up my website so you can actually see what it looks like. This is what it looks like in, in, in AdSense, excuse me, this is how it looks in iWeb. Obviously you don't see any ads right now but when you go to it on the internet there are ads. I have ads on the left and the right and I have ads at the bottom um, and all that is what the workaround I'm going to show you right now. So, again, if you click right here, you'll actually see that um, I did find a way to input the ads and I'm not using the iWeb system, I'm using a totally separate system. So, the first thing you want to do is, let's see, I have an ad down here as well. I'm going to put my ad down here at the bottom. So, what you want to do is you're going to go to the internet. So, I'm going to go to Safari. Let me pull Safari over here. And from here, I'm going to go to my AdSense account. So basically, I'm going to go to google.com uh, backslash AdSense. Google.com slash AdSense. And it will take me to my AdSense account. And it'll ask you to sign in. Okay. Hit remind me later. And so this is my AdSense page here. Now from there you would click on my ads and then you'll see these are a couple of the ads I've already created. Now click on new ad unit and you want to name it. So I'm just going to put um, home page and um, bottom ad. Okay. Now you're going to choose the size of the ad that you want and I'm going to look at the horizontal banners and I'll do a half banner okay so I'll click half banner and then here you can choose the type of ads you want text only if you want text and image I normally recommend text and image because they're a little bit more appealing to the eye um, next here you can choose what color the ad is so the default ad is going to have a white background with the color text you can switch it and have a black background this will actually blend in better with my site because my site is all black so uh, but I'm not going to do that I'm just going to pick the Google default and then I'm going to click save and get code now what will pop up here is the code to input into my site you're going to click one time it highlights everything right click click copy now we will minimize that and it will take us back to uh, iWeb here okay now once you're in iWeb come down to the bottom right click on show media and then we're going to drag an HTML snippet uh, to the bottom here. Okay? And then you're going to uh, right click in the box and paste. And that will put your ad in there and you're going to click apply. When you do that, it will turn into the size of the ad that you chose um, in terms of AdSense. Now, after that, you're going to click publish site. And it will now basically publish the changes that you made to your site. And after you give it a second, a message will pop up and it will ask if you want to visit the site. Now normally it takes uh, a couple of minutes for the ad to kind of like pop up. So it could take anywhere from, you know, it could come up right now or it could come up in about an hour. But it does work nonetheless. So now we're going to click visit site now. And it will bring up uh, the site here. My normal ads on the left and right. And it has not showed up yet because again sometimes it, it can take a little time for that code to sync up with Google and then for them to place an ad so um, give it about 20 minutes at the most an hour there was even a time that I placed an ad 
and I thought it wasn't working and so I started putting all these other ads in I came back like a little bit later and then the ad was there and I was like whoa I thought it wasn't working so um, just give it a little bit of time the ad will pop up uh, in in some past cases in iWeb for some reason it only let me like have three Google ads on a page uh, I don't know if it's going to do the same thing just because um, I'm not using the iWeb system. I'm really just using an HTML snippet. So anyway, that's how you add a Google ad into iWeb. And it's basically, again, a workaround because iWeb is no longer supporting the software. So they're not doing any updates, which is why that their, ad, their AdSense system doesn't work anymore. So hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like the video if you did find it helpful. Subscribe to Extreme Tech Videos and have a good one.